Exporting an animation in Motion Builder is pretty horrible, especially if you want to work in a non-destructive way. So how would we do this? Uh, first, we would need to duplicate the take, see that we have some animations. Then we would need to plot it to the skeleton and then to the control rig. Then we will need to go to schematic view, select all of the joints that you want to export and then hit motion file export. Then you just export it to the folder that you want to export to, name it test and save. Then just hit that take you want to save, export. That's a lot of steps just to export an animation. Oh, and I also forgot to actually delete the duplicated take. And now we have exported an animation in a non-destructive way. This is my export animation tool. It does exactly what I did previously, but with one button. You can either choose to export from character or selection. If you choose character, then it will export all of the skin joints that belongs to the current character that you have active. So if we hit export, name it whatever you want and hit save. And finally, we can test this by just drag and dropping it to, for example, Maya. And there we go. We have the animation exported. Going back to Motion Builder, we see that the keys are still there. Uh, the original take is not plotted or anything, so it's non-destructive. And you can just continue doing whatever you were doing. If you have multiple characters in the scene, just make sure that you have the right character active. And you can easily change them by either clicking here or just selecting the control rig to change which character you want to export. If whatever you want to export does not have a control rig, then you can export from selection. And that's useful for environment animation or anything that does not use human IK. Since it's based on selection, then you will need to select whatever you want to export and then hit export. We'll just replace this. And when we import it to Maya, it works. Very nice. Export from selection is not limited to joints only. You can export anything that you have selected. For example, a mesh. So if we hit export, uh, save, import the cube, and here we go. You did it. And finally, you have the option to remove namespace on the exported objects. And this will only affect the exported objects, not anything in the scene. So as you can see, my character has a namespace. But if I hit remove namespace and hit export and just save, import the animation, you'll see that the namespaces are gone and it still works. This tool is dockable, so you can dock it to wherever you want. But I just prefer it to leave it in the side like this. Also, remember to go to Layout and click the Prevent Docking so that the tool doesn't try to dock everywhere when you try to move this. But if you want to dock it, you just need to hold Shift and then move it. Then you can dock. There's a link to the download page in the description if you want the script. And if you want to learn how to run a script in Motion Builder and assign it to a shortcut, then I'll have another video in the description below. Goodbye.